guys, it's Timmy, and this is Wrestling Unlimited, as I have to say, spoiler alert for tonight's AEW Dynamite, as tonight's Dynamite does take place in Cardiff, Wales, and the show has already been filmed. Now, all these spoilers do come from what we were able to gather on social media, most specifically Twitter, and people that were there posting things while at the show live. So let's kick it all off and talk about the spoilers we know for tonight's show. In a dark match, international star Michael Oku actually made his big AEW debut, defeating Serpentico. As far as the main show does go, Chris Jericho did defeat Tommy Billington. During the match, Jericho responded to Please Retire Chance by getting on the microphone and saying that the fans only wanted him to retire so he could help the Cardiff Football Club. Hook would come out after the match to confront Jericho, but was attacked from behind by Big Bill. As far as the contract signing goes between Mercedes Monet and Britt Baker, Tony Schiavone hosted the segment and said both Baker and Monet had agreed to, quote, no physicality during this segment. Monet said that Baker is the past and she is the future. Baker said that when she thinks of the past, she thinks of AEW All-In last year when Monet hobbled into the stadium to watch her wrestle. Monet then got a, quote, shut the F up, Chan, at one point from the crowd. Baker said that she would agree to the rules and not hit Monet. But that didn't apply to Camille. Baker then hit Camille with a microphone, then dove off the table onto her with a big high cross. We saw the AEW Women's World Championship on the line where Tony Storm did successfully defend the title against Soraya. After the match, Tony Storm was attacked by Mariah May with the shoe. Renee Paquette then did an interview segment with Hangman Adam Page where he did confirm that he will be in the Casino Gauntlet match at All In this Sunday. Evil Uno then would show up and reveal, hey, I'm going to be in the match as well, and then Will Page attacked Evil Uno. We had a face-to-face -face segment between MJF and Will Ospreay, where Ospreay initiated things by getting physical first, and security came down to try to break things up. By the end of this, we did see photos of Will Ospreay laying in the ring, laid out, bloodied, and Christopher Daniels standing over him, checking on him. The AEW Continental Championship was on the line when Kazuchika Okada defended against Claudio Castagnoli, but there was no winner and there was no loser because the match actually ended up going to a time limit draw. And then finally, Brian Danielson and Swerve did come out for their quote-unquote final segment, final showdown segment, I guess they called it, before AEW All In, but we didn't really get many details on what happened during this segment other than, well, the both just came out and talked. With that, those are the spoilers for tonight's AEW Dynamite that has already taken place in Cardiff, Wales, but will air here in the United States tonight on TBS. With that, if we do hear anything further on AEW Dynamite leading into All In this weekend, we'll have it for you right here. Pro Wrestling Unlimited.